Three, two, one. Yo, what's up? I just say good morning, everybody. Good morning, YouTube. So, I'm about to start off my day by going to the bank here in a minute. Now, I'm dropping off this, I'm dropping off what I made yesterday. So, it's currently, what is it like, Sunday? Bruh. <laughs> so, uh, this vlog here. It's not gonna be as long as yesterday's vlog. I had a lot of uh, trouble uploading that vlog. Like seriously, I didn't. Even, uh, it, it tripped me out because I've watched hours worth. I've watched like an hour-long video before, or a few. I mean, a few hour-long videos on YouTube, 30-minute-long videos, and mine was like 18 minutes long. And it kept telling me, it kept on telling me that I couldn't upload this video because it was too long. I'm like what the hell until I had to verify my account I'm like what the fuck why did I have to verify my account damn it's like I'm already verified I'm there I, I uploaded videos I'm here so it was a it was a trip actually so um yeah anyways last night I would have vlogged um me and my family we was watching the uh the full moon the blood moon or the big blood moon or whatever uh, people want to call it yeah, it was pretty cool it was pretty intense I mean I've seen I've seen them seen them before a lot of people act like they've never happened <laughs> but I've seen plenty of them and I'm currently on my balcony right here <laughs> it's not not too great of a view but the balcony so yeah I'm about to do that and of course I gotta stop by I gotta go to go get me a coffee and give me a frap Start me off. I'm chilling with this little monction. Thor. Thor. What you doing? What are you doing? What? What's wrong? You on the camera? Okay. Okay, he's itching. <laughs> Anyways, I hope everyone having a good day, or a good morning, a good start to the day, and have a good day, and uh, come along with me to see them, check out what I'm doing today, which is not going to be very much today, it's going to be a chill day, and um, anyways, I'll have uh, a lot of stuff I'm going to be doing for you guys and for the vlogs, so stay with me, and I'll see you at the next teleportation spot. Stay Phantomous, you already know. What's up, guys? <laughs> I just made it to uh, McDonald's. I don't know if you can see me through the lighting. I hate the lighting. I just made it to McDonald's, and I didn't, like, vlog the way here because right now I'm, like, biking. So, you know, keeping it healthy, keeping it right. But I'm actually just here to get a frap. And then, yeah, because I just left the bank, and I ran into a good friend of mine, Caitlin. So, you know, we talked or whatever. And, uh, so right now I'm just about to go ahead and get this frap real quick. I guess I'll, I'll take you. I'll take you with me. Let's see. Into McDonald's. I thought the lighting would be way better, but it's all right. about some stuff later on today. Which would be uh, fun. <laughs> and uh, actually I just need you a little bit. I need to tell you guys some stuff about me in case you don't know or anybody who's like, mm, just guys, I just want to check them out right quick. I'll tell you some stuff about myself. If you don't like listen to the music, you don't listen to the music or, you know, listen to me or whatever I do, or if you just happen to stumble across this vlog, I'll let you know what's up with me and everything, and then I'll get back to you in a second, because you know how I teleport, it's like, bang, bam, <laughs> still in McDonald's, eventually, 
I'll get my frap. I already ordered them this way. Oh, man. You know what? I got some really, really good news about a certain recording situation, but I know it's not going to pop off soon. Matter of fact, some, a lot of things that I already talked to you guys about, like uh, the new house and the car and all of that, it's not going to be coming for some months because we're really working on getting everything together and putting everything in order. Uh, your boy got to be, your boy got to be rolling. And right now my license is suspended because I did something crazy at Dollar General. So, <laughs> oh man, they got me good. They got me good. I'll tell Bruh. you guys about it sometime. But, all right. Whenever this gets here, I'm booking. I'm on the bike. I'm getting that exercise in. That's what I'm doing right now. So, because even then, since I, I, I might smoke, but. The boy get it. The boy gets it done. So, you know. It's good for my lungs. I get around any way I can. But I am not a fan of walking, but I do. I would. Alright. See you guys at the next warp. Isn't she gorgeous? <laughs> All right, we're warped back to the house on the balcony here. Got a wrap, which is delicious. Man, I was kind of pretentious to be like, oh, at McDonald's getting wrap or whatever, but shit's delicious. I don't like Starbucks. Mochas and shit. Unless somebody can hit me with some Starbucks that's on point, you know what I'm saying, or whatever. Hit me with that green tea. You know I do that green tea. <laughs> but yeah, I wanted to say, uh, for those of you who don't know me, I'm on Tyrus Kimball. And I have, uh, I'm really, really bipolar in nature. I sometimes have like random depression, which is you know terrible. But it actually, and you know, I hate going through. I hate going through depressions, or when I'm like just randomly angry about something, or hating on, uh, just hating on anything, just hating, you know, just hating to hate. But I do that. I hate. I get depressed. Get emotional sometimes, and uh, yeah, I don't know. You know, it inspires good songs or whatever. It's cool to inspire good songs, but at the same time, I don't like feeling like that all the time because I know, like, I believe in a law of attraction, and I believe that if I, you know, basically if the universe, if I believe I deserve it, the universe will serve it, you know. And lately, you know, uh, it's been it's been serving, but also it, it takes away, so it's an equivalent exchange factor about like life and how I live and me, myself, and people, you know, so. In order to gain something, you have to give something up. I feel like it's like that. And uh, sometimes it's just it depends on what's leaving, you know. So, like, when I was basically, when I learned how to, when I started learning how to make money on uh, online and um, running ads and campaigns and when I started to learn editing and, um, like, remixing, like, music and uh, mixing, mastering, well, I learned those trades, but then my computer crashed just randomly, just because, just because, just starting to pick up the video editing and it crashed, and I just kind of stopped on that. So now I'm back on it, you know, trying to do it through these iPads and my phone and things that I can do it with. So, you know, that's just like one small example of equivalent exchange. Um, so, hmm. I may have episodes of just I want to do shit. I mean, like a month ago, my room was it was fucking terrible. It was wrong. There's a man cave in there. Man cave. You know, I was like, I, I was sleeping, just like sleeping until like five o'clock and stuff. You know, I was just in a rut because 
the job situations going, it was going to just, it's terrible. So I was like, oh my God, man, I gotta, gotta get out of it. So I made a list, a list of goals to accomplish. And one, the number one on that, on that list was cleaning my room. And now, if uh, you've seen, um, it's basically spotless because I got up one day and I cleaned it, and then I stayed up for like three days so that I can actually fix my schedule. I stayed up for three days straight so that I can fall asleep at like 10 and wake up <laughs> at 8 or 9. So I had to fix it. You know, I had to fix it. I started getting out more because I, it's not that I push a lot of people out of my life. It's just that a lot of people leave my life uh, because uh, I guess because of the way I am. And, uh, you know, my best friend, he, he he's, he's off doing his thing. You know, he says it's because people grow. And uh, I don't know. I kind of feel like he screwed me to be honest, but, because, you know, I don't have a lot of people to talk to all the time. You know, of course, I have my, uh, my family and my girlfriend, and, you know, that service, that's, that's great, but, you know, I had a, I had a lot of friends that I just kind of took for granted, and I pushed out of my life when I was younger, and now that it's just like everything has changed, so, um, everyone's doing their own kind of thing. So, and I haven't, I haven't went out of my way to go, like, get him back. It's that one of my friends, I tried to get him back, but I couldn't. He's lost. He's just lost, not even to me. He's just lost to the world, actually. He's a good dude, though. He's a real good dude. And, um, man. Anyway, my boy Joey, that's my boy Robbie, that's my boy Brian. They, they're always with me, but we, like, we and I like always together when I was hanging out, but we're always, we're bros at heart. We got that pack, you know, so we're bros at heart. And, uh, you know, right now, Brian's off serving military status right now, and he's, I hope he's doing good, but, Thor, come on. <laughs> Thor's trying to take my checkbook. But, yeah. I, I've, uh, I lost some friends. And uh, had a problem, you know, had a problem with drugs and uh, partying all the time and drinking all the time and stuff. I kind of pushed a lot of people out of my life because of that fact. And uh, because everybody wanted to get turned up and uh, turned up before turned up was a term, you know, this is like three years ago, you know, young. So, you know, before anything was anything, you know, we were always partying, drinking, selling drugs, I'm doing my thing, you know, and uh, to get out of that life, I pushed a lot of people out, but, you know, I feel like a lot of them were good people, um, so, yeah, you know, I kind of look at a lot of my old friends, then, and a lot of them are in, uh, rehab, jail, dead, and, uh, some are doing, doing great, so, you know, I don't know. Sometimes I'm happy I turn my life around, and sometimes it's like I just I missed I missed part I miss turning up. I miss partying a lot. I miss it. I miss the the drug factor. You know, I miss just waking up not knowing where the fuck I am. Some other town, some house, some girl. You know, I mean to say that, and it's like okay, I'm kind of disrespecting my girl like that, right? But she knows like how I am and how, how what I what I talk about, and how I feel as to what I do and what I don't do. I know the do's and the don'ts, but sometimes it's just, it's just how I feel sometimes, you know, so, you know, we, and we have an interesting relationship anyways, but, I don't know if I'm like recording this right, but, yeah, so I just want to tell you guys about, like, some of that stuff, and, um, I mean, I'll get deeper, I just don't want to make this too long, I'll get deeper with it, and I got, I got a lot of stuff to tell you guys, stories and things like that, you know, since I don't have a, completely like just a friend to like completely talk to you know I want to talk to more than just one person obviously so you know uh talk to you guys whoever's listening and uh with that said I'm gonna go ahead and like end this vlog which is in the daytime uh, <laughs> because I don't really want to drag it up and uh just let me know if anybody wants longer vlogs shorter vlogs whatever I'll do I'll do what I can so I want you guys to stay phantomous Stay getting it, to keep it on that grind, keep grinding, grind out hard, because freedom is basically money. I mean, it's hard, it's bad to say it, but that's the truth. Freedom is money out here. So, get that money, keep
keep banking, keep grinding, you know, do your 90 day challenges, Shh, lose your weight if you got it, you know, I seen a guy in Walmart, I mean in uh, McDonald's just a little while ago, dude was like, I mean, 400 pounds, man, in McDonald's, yo, he's really using, he's really living that YOLO life, like YOLO life, dude, I wouldn't, if I'm 400, I'm, I'm avoiding McDonald's or anywhere, so, you know, shout out to people who get it, and shout out to people who, like, know that they deserve something better than whatever they have in life, and shout out to the grind, most definitely, so, everyone stay phantomous, and I'll catch y'all in the next vlog.